In this video, we're going to have a quick look at hooking up an ARM um, Cortex M3 based uh, microcontroller to I2C to measure temperature and humidity. Uh, this uh, processor is hosted on a board built by NXP and it complies or it's compliant with Embed, which makes it very easy to program. You can program it through a web IDE or you can import your project into the tools like Keel and uh, and work directly on there. But as you'll see, the code, if you look at the link, is uh, using the embed libraries where all the nasty complexity, as I see it, is encapsulated inside C++ classes well out of sight. And uh, as I see it, you can then just focus on the code, which is great. Anyway, let's have a look. Here's the code actually running. You can see it's measuring temperature and relative humidity. If I stick my finger on the temperature probe, you can see it goes up, and I take my finger off, and it should come down as well. Okay, and now if we switch, you can also see the LEDs flashing. Uh, on the breadboard there, there's an, an NXP LPC1768 board. And this is one of the embed compliant boards. In fact, I think this is the first one they did. Uh, the I2C interface is hooked up directly onto what's called a weather cape. There are a few sensors on there. I'm using a temperature and humidity sensor. And uh, the weather cape is actually for the BeagleBone, which, and it's a revision one of the BeagleBone weather cape. Um, and uh, I'm just reusing that for a different project. Um, and probably worth pointing out that uh, we've, with the embed box, we get this very, very nice, useful pin reference card which I found really valuable through the whole thing. And uh, looking at the NXP now, you can see we're actually also flashing into, um, onboard LEDs, which are hooked up to GPIO pins, and an external LED as well. And that's it. Very, very simple to do. Um, just a little bit of battling with the I2C protocol, but uh, once I've read the datasheet properly, um, it was straightforward.